Mr. Speaker, I hadn't included it in my prayer, but I will pray for flexibility for all of us today. Okay? Let's pray together. Oh, gracious God, it is time to pray. When we begin so many meetings, another morning session, even worship services, and there are so many distractions. Help us to stop and see we need these moments to be still and know that you are God. O oh Lord, our God, we ask for this body of servants to have the discernment of Solomon to govern and guide your people who have so many worries about the present and the future. We ask your blessings on these men and women of the house who feel the enormous responsibility in making decisions that affect millions of people. O oh God, we pray that you place your loving arms around these representatives and give them your strength. Fill them with your courage and speak to them so that they will know wisdom greater than their own. Oh God, when they grow weary from visitors at their office doors, another meeting, or pressure from all kinds of competing positions, would you renew their strength and vision for their great work? Holy God, during this season of Lent, we come before you in repentance and humility, regardless of all of our differences. We stand as brothers and sisters needing your healing forgiveness. We ask that in your grace you give these servants a sacred and holy moment to put their trust in you before they take up the business of the day. Loving God, give us eyes and hearts to see the good and worth in each other and the common struggles we share. We pray that all of us may be delivered from parties and politics to partnerships from divisions to determination and finding common ground in our differences, from anxiety and the approval of men to accomplishing a, a purpose for the greater good. As this prayer ends, help us to know our conversation and communion with you is not finished. Our dependency on you is not over. Or may we not forget, O oh God, you are always speaking to us. We ask this in the name of the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.